Even though a nice quiet getaway during an off season is of course enjoyable, there is something fun about venturing into a city when you when when you know you're in for kind of a busy experience. And festivals mm -hmm. certainly have that kind of feel. A great thing about festivals is they bring together people with similar interests, food and entertainment, always a big draw. Central Florida has a lot of them. And later on this month, there is an event being called the Country for a Cause. And News 6 Insider Guy Crystal Boyer is here now with the details on that. This Memorial Day weekend, tens of thousands of veterans will be honored at Daytona International Speedway during the Heroes Honor Festival. It's a two-day inaugural event. I spoke to the organizer who says he wants to give back to the veterans who supported him after returning from deployment. The vision really came into my heart uh, when I came home from Iraq. A vision to honor veterans in a unique way. Ben Peterson, an eight-year Army veteran, says many of his brothers and sisters didn't feel welcome after returning from Iraq, some not making it home alive. Protesters began to show up at Iraq veteran funerals uh, because they disagreed with the war in Iraq. And so you've got to imagine, you know, families are trying to mourn the death of their son or daughter and protesters are showing up. Peterson says it was a group of Vietnam veterans that started a movement, showing up to support families during funerals and homecoming events, some experiencing the same negative gestures when returning from war. When I got off the bus in 2009, the first thing that I saw was over 100 Vietnam veterans lined up shoulder to shoulder, American flag, standing watch over my welcome home. How did it make you feel to see that support from other veterans who didn't get that type of welcome themselves? Yeah, it was it was pretty powerful. You know, I, I kind of stood there and did a double take. You know, when I knew I was looking into the eyes of men that had been shamed, had been called baby killers. We've heard atrocious stories from hundreds of Vietnam veterans of the way they were treated. Our group of 20 was surrounded by protesters screaming and calling us names like baby killers. One protester spit in the face of the Marine beside me. We never expected such hate. We ran to the USO for refuge. When I got home, no one mentioned Vietnam. No one welcomed me home. I didn't understand why they were so angry with us. Uh, there was a lot of hollering at us and cussing us and stuff like that. Accounts described by several Vietnam veterans in interviews shared by Peterson and the organization he founded, Engage Your Destiny, a faith-based nonprofit supporting active military personnel, veterans, and their families. After nearly three years of planning, Peterson's vision is coming to life, hosting one of the largest festivals to support Vietnam veterans and other servicemen and women in the U.S. The Heroes Honor Festival is a two-day event held during Memorial Day weekend at Daytona Beach. The festival includes performances with country music stars Toby Keith, Justin Moore, and Craig Morgan. There are scheduled flyovers, a candlelight vigil, and division reunions for veterans. We want them to feel honored, but also I think there's going to be a sense of closure for a lot of Vietnam veterans um, that have never uh, truly been celebrated in this way. Um, and we're hoping, we're praying, we're believing that this can truly be a healing uh, and closure moment for those families. The Heroes Honor Festival takes place May 27th and 28th at the Daytona International Speedway. Tickets are free for veterans, active duty military, and their spouses. If you want to go to support our veterans, you can purchase tickets for $99. Proceeds from ticket sales help support the organization hoping the event, uh, hosting the event. And if you want to show your support, but you're a bit tight on funds, we've got you covered. For our insiders, we have three pairs of tickets to give away to this event. You can enter the giveaway on clickrelando.com slash insider through Monday. And if you are maybe a veteran or a spouse, you want to apply for those free tickets, we have that information on clickrelando.com slash insider as well. But it, what a great yes. way to also, mm -hmm. you know, spend your time on Memorial Day, you know, because you feel like you're really finally able to, to give back to so many. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and just hearing the story behind how this organization was started, yeah. it really is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and you know, they actually have reunions scheduled during this two-day event. So on that Friday, you know, you can apply to get those free tickets if you're a veteran and meet up with maybe some of the men or women that were part of your group. So it's kind of like wow. getting that closure, just, you know, catching up with someone that you haven't seen for a while. So nice. Yeah, great story. Thank you, Crystal.